Hi guys. Today I want to do something a little different. I was low on inspiration and wasn't sure what kind of video to make and then an idea hit me. And I think I'm going to go ahead and do something a little more old school. I wasn't around when these videos were super popular so I never got to make one. So I thought today I would do a what's in my bag video. Because I used to love watching these, but I've just never had the chance to make one. My purse makes pretty great noises. It's kind of a green color. And it's by Gianni Bini. See right here. And it is, I think you call this a hobo shape. This is the back right here. It has one strip. And each of the straps has two parts in the middle, right? And there are also metal feet. It's a really nice texture. It's kind of like a snake skin material almost. So, I like how it feels. Go ahead and show you what's in my purse. Um, okay. This is the first thing that's in my purse. It is a metal tin and it has a peacock on it because I love peacocks. And the back's just plain. Um, this, I believe, is a cigarette case. I don't smoke, so I'm going to show you what I have inside of here. This is my box of secret weapons. I have my headphones. And I have earplugs. Because, as many of you know, I do suffer from misophonia, which I have self diagnosed myself with, so I have a hard time being in public places without worrying about noises or things that are going to make me upset, so um, we recently went to, um, well my boyfriend recently had surgery, and I knew I was going to be sitting in the waiting room for about three or four hours, so I went ahead and got some earplugs just in case someone was chewing gum or there were annoying noises. So I put these in here and I packed my earphones in here as well. That way I would be ready just in case something were to happen. So, these were my little saviors, and no one was chewing gum, and no one was irritating, and I didn't have to wear them, and I'm really happy about it, but I'm super glad that I have them just in case, and now I'm just going to keep these in my purse for all the time, because it never feels that I end up 
somewhere with someone who was doing something annoying to me and I want earphones or headphones to block out the noise, so that's the first thing that's in there. are my car keys. It's not very exciting. Um, I have a bottle opener because um, one of my friends lives by a river and we went to the river one day and I had some woodchucks with me and if you guys know me, I don't know that you've never talked about it, I love woodchuck. So I didn't realize that they were bottle opener lids and we spent the whole day trying to open them without a bottle opener, so I saw this and it was, I think, maybe 99 cents, so I went ahead and picked this up for next time. I have a Rite Aid card, Planet Fitness, PetSmart, Petco, American Eagle, Library, Grocery Store, that's pretty much McGee's. thing I have, this is my wallet, and it's my favorite color, which is a teal. And I've had this wallet for several years because I just love the color of it, and I think I actually had it in a different color before, maybe a red. I kept it. I got one in this color also, so... Receipt, another receipt, um, I have my cards, they're all backwards so you can't see them, and then in this section, this is the way, in this section of my wallet I have all of my other cards, let me see what I have in here, uh, Sally Beauty Club, and Body Works, Johnny Carino's, Orange Leaf, um, an old Monopoly card, Let's see. Starbucks gift card, Car Wash, Car Wash, Daiquiri Place, um, Casino. So those are pretty much all the cards that I have in there. Oh, here's my ID from when I was in college. My first semester, this is my first week of college. I'll show you guys this so you can see that. You can't see that. Never mind. Just kidding. Okay. Here's my ID picture of me when I was a freshman in college. So cute. So there's that, and let's see, let me look in this bag section, if I have anything back here. The only thing I have is a receipt from Bath and Body Works. There was supposed to be a survey that has been sun bleached, and now you can't see doesn't help me. And I have a coupon from there. You guys remember I used to work there. So those are probably both in there from when I worked there years ago. Coffee shop. I don't even know. Okay. So that's it for my wallet. Seat from grocery shopping. Um, oh. This is this this way so it doesn't click on it. An unopened thing of chapstick that I got for my boyfriend when he had his surgery because they put a breathing tube in him and I thought that his lips would be dry. 
so he picked this flavor, which is so gross. I would never want apple cider flavored chapstick, but that was his pick. And I put it in my purse so it didn't melt in the car. <laughs> and then we forgot about it. Okay, I have money floating around. For five whole dollars, watch out. Five dollars, y'all. So, five dollars. <laughs> I never have cash. Sucrets cough drops. I really like Sucrets. If you have a sore throat, um, because it makes your throat feel so good. And it basically numbs it. And you can't feel any sore throatness anymore. So I have this flavor, which is Cool Citrus. Which is not my preference. I usually get... Maybe it's a cherry, but for some reason I think they didn't have it, so I tried this one. It's okay, but I'm just used to the other one, so cough drops. Got to have that. Um, here is a hand lotion that I have. You can't even see that. It's a Vaseline Total Moisture, and... It has, it's a clean feeling lotion for healthy soft skin. It has pure oat extract, Stratus 3, multi-layer moisture. So, let's put some of this on while we find it. I used to never use hand lotion because my skin is really oily. But, um, recently, like within the past few months or so, I've started using hand lotion because I've noticed my hands are really dry. And I've never had dry skin before, so I like this one because it's very, like it says, what does it say on my hand? Clean feeling. Like it's already absorbed now. I mean, it's dry. My fingers are dry. And I like that a lot because I don't, because my skin is oily, I don't like having like a greasy residue on my hands, so that's typically why I never use lotion is because I hate that feeling, but with this one I really like it, so if you don't like that feeling, go for this one. I feel like I'm always trying new lotions because I can't find one of the texture I like, but this one's pretty good just to carry in your purse, so there's that. Next thing, oh! Crackers. Also, um, when we were in surgery, because I thought I'd get hungry, so I packed snacks, because I didn't know how long I'd be sitting there, so I need to get rid of these. <laughs> um, I have a pen, which is always important to have. And a nail polish that my sister gave me. It is the China Glaze Polish in Flip Flop Fantasy, and she's kind of crazy about this color, so um, she gave me a bottle to try, and I'm going to go ahead and try it right now for you guys so you can see what it looks like. I'm just going to do one nail, if I can open it. Oh my gosh, I just put lotion on. springy color, summer color. It's kind of like a pinky orange color. I don't know if you can see that or not, but um, yeah, you can kind of see it. Okay. I cannot believe this thing won't open.
eyes are really bright. Brighter than I was expecting it to be. So, this is what it looks like. I just stuck it straight in my hair. Perfect. So there is the flip flop fantasy. I should probably do all of my nails instead of just one, but we're just trying it out, right? So let me turn this back on. As you can see, that's pretty much it. Let me see what else. Oh, I have a ring in here. Because I am always famous for wearing a ring somewhere and then taking it off because it gets on my nerves. <laughs> So, there's my ring. It's not real. It's just sparkly and fun. I think it's like Swarovski crystals or something. So, love that. The next thing are my lip products that I have. And I've never been a big lip product person. I hate stuff on my lips. But um, I've been watching a lot of beauty videos lately. And I'm kind of obsessed with lip stuff now. So, I picked up this EOS Balm to kind of prime my lips with, and it's just a round thing like this, and I think the flavor I got is maybe like a strawberry lemonade, like a tropical something, I don't know, so it smells really good, and I don't mind the texture of it on my lips, so keep that in my purse for when I need it, and I'll put that on before I put lipstick on. Um, this is one of the, I think I put this on in my makeup video maybe, uh, the NYX, it's called a lip pencil, but I use it as a lip color. Um, it's called Chaos, and it's really bright pink. I don't know if you can see that. That light is just awful. Okay, so it's really bright pink. Um, love it for summer, so I wore this the other night we went out for a friend's birthday. And I had this on, so it's in my purse because I wanted it for touch-ups. Um, this is another lipstick that I have in there. And the color is Pink and Proper. And it is by Maybelline. And it is the Color Sensational line. And it looks like this. Put that one next to it. This one is more of a creamy pink. You can see it's this one right here. Um, not really that big of a fan of things with like an iridescent shimmer to it. And I didn't know that it had that in there before I got it. So I'll wear it to layer it with something, but it's not my favorite. And the last thing. Oh, there's another ring. Here's another ring that's in my purse. It's just like a little gold wavy band thing. I think it's a stackable ring. So that's in there. This is my favorite lipstick in the whole world. And I know I said I'm not a lipstick person, but I found this lipstick on Pinterest. And I am like the world's worst person at picking lip colors. So I saw that this was pinned. And I just fell in love with it. And I said, there's no way that that's going to look good on me because I can pick a color from two feet away and it's awful. But something about this when I saw it on the internet, I loved it. And it is a Revlon uh, Color Burst Lip Butter. And the color is Macaroon. So I went you know, to four or five different stores looking for this color. I couldn't find it anywhere. So I did research online because I get obsessive about things like that. Um, and I found out that it is a UK only release color. So we have these in our stores in the States, but we have, you know, 12 or 15 colors of it, but not this one. This was only in the UK. So 
I decided to be really smart and go on Amazon UK and I ordered this and I paid $20 for it, including shipping. This lip butter is probably like $7 at the store. So I paid the outrageous British price of like 12 pounds. No, that's not right. It's the opposite. I don't know. Anyway. But with shipping, it came out to like $20, and I had never even tried this lipstick on, and I'm awful at picking colors. So, when this came in, I was a little apprehensive at first, but it is by far my favorite lip product I've ever used. And it looks like this. And it's really, really sheer, but it has like a really, really pretty color to it. And that's the color right there. I don't know if you can see it. I'll put it on my lips for you guys. I don't have any makeup on. That's what it looks like on. It's really light and sheer. And I am obsessed with it. So I keep getting like really mad at myself because I keep forgetting it in my purse. And I leave my purse in my car sometimes at night. And it's like 100 degree index heat index here right now. So um, it's kind of melting. But I will probably order another one. Just because I know how much I love it and enjoy it. So. That is my favorite lip product, and I'm going to go ahead and put everything back in my purse now. Here's my wallet, cough drops, keys, all my lip products go in this little pouch that I have, and put those in there, um, let me get this chopstick. four years <laughs> and I wear it every summer because it's really light in the summer and I just love it so and everything that's in it and I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I hope maybe this will inspire other new ASMR people to make a what's in my bag video thanks for watching see you soon